There have been reports late last week and over the weekend that the Basel III bank liquidity rule will be delayed. It was supposed to take effect January 1st, 2015. There's talks now that it may be postponed until the middle of 2015. Banks had been opposed to all of this because they said they would have to hold too much cash on their balance sheets, wouldn't be able to lend it out. Sebastian Gali of SockGen writes in his daily note that this is a big deal. Why? It matters a lot more than a hypothetical rate cut from the ECB as it determines the overall price of risk, mainly in Europe. It is an indication of a decision to ease via more powerful tools. So if you delay Basel III, that's another way of creating easy money, yeah. another way of easing monetary conditions, yep. easing the pressure in the system. Mm. My morning must read has to do with the fiscal cliff. It's a view from Ed Luce of the Financial Times warning of the risks. And what it all comes down to is recession. And I can tell you after spending some time with Europeans this weekend, they are very worried about this. This is the imminent threat to the global economy. America's Thelma and Louise moment. The final scene could end with recession instead of with the Grand Canyon. There is little reason to believe that the election results of November 6th have changed any fundamentals. Politics, a bit like the stock market, it's hard to predict the next gyration always safer to trust the longer-term trends, and the longer-term trends are not that hot. So